family welcome to the channel i hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day in today's video guys we'll be reacting to turkey builds more than 50,000 homes uh, for Syrians. this video was suggested by omer hand 42 tashakur termagasi thank you very much for taking the time to send me a recommendation and suggestion the video is by uh, trt world and the link is in the description in case you guys wanted to check it out so inshallah we'll get started with the video in just a couple of uh, seconds and at the end of the video i'll share with you guys my observation and reactions so if you want to see that then please stay until uh, the end with that said no let's get started with our video this is one of the sites some 50 kilometers from idlib city center the turkish mm, government to and various turkish ngos have been building these houses for the syrian families we're told each house costs around a thousand dollars now wow. previously in these wet and cold conditions the syrian families had been camping outside in the open uh -huh. or in some cases in the tents that had been provided to them but the turkish government said that the conditions had been miserable and now the condition has improved significantly now so far in idlib around 25,000 of these houses have been constructed. The Turkish government plans to construct around 50,000 of these houses just in the Idlib province. Let's just uh, take a look at one of these houses and see what they're like. Assalamu alaikum. So, so, shukran. So we'll just show you what the houses are like. We're told two rooms in each house. So there's a small kitchen area not bad also. there's a toilet and we've got one of the rooms here oh that's what we used to have back home to in afghanistan and another one in which there is a family so we're not going to go in there we so, to call it Bukhari. basically fifty thousand of these houses are going to be constructed across Idlib province of Syria and uh, the Turkish officials say that that's not going to be it. The areas that have been cleared by Turkish military operations Euphrates Shield and Olive Branch, Turkey has also been constructing houses in those areas. The plan is to allow the internally displaced Syrians to occupy those houses uh, the Turkish government says that it hopes that's going to improve conditions for them until there is a permanent solution for the Syrians. Now, many people, we understand, from across Idlib have moved to these camps where they say they feel secure, the conditions are much better than what they were in, and of course there is that relative security which is present. So uh, some security is provided by the the groups that Turkey has trained, they are policing this area and they tell us, the people we've spoken to, that the law and order situation here is, um, they feel secure basically, and also these areas are not being targeted by the Assad regime. On the political front, of course, Turkey has been dealing with Moscow and with Tehran and trying to get others involved as well to try and find a solution that will basically pull the Syrians out of their misery. Also, so as the previous video we reacted to Syria, um, I mentioned that you know they've been going through this war for like uh, almost a decade now, and uh, as uh, the reporter mentioned previously, they used to live in in tents, and uh, you know when fall or the winter would come or times where the weather was bad, like it's raining or snowing. Um, it would be a really tough uh, situation. So subhanAllah to see this, that Turkey has gone uh, above and beyond to build them an actual shelter, which is basically like a home, although it's a little small, but it is better, for example, than being in a tent. You know, they have a little bit of a space for the kitchen, washroom, and there's an actual room where they have, for example, the heater that maybe it's powered by wood, uh, but at least it's better and probably warmer and more secure than it is in, in a tent. So. You know, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless uh, Turkey and may Allah, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bring peace to, to Syria so, you know, everybody can return back to their life and they don't have to live in this, uh, these conditions. So thank you very much, guys, 
for suggesting this video i hope you guys like this reaction if you did please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and if you like me to react to any other videos you can put your suggestions in the comment section below as always tashak or terima can say thank you very much shukran and mercy guys for all your love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day take care of yourself and your family inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care wassalam